I love this mill. There's one woman and two acres. I already cut the door out, and I'm having to recess the hinges so that they actually fit. She's probably going to make this weaker, but at this point, I don't care. Um, so I have to create another one. If I have a chisel on my little mallet. Make the outline. Maybe I should sharpen this thing. What do you think? That'll be that'll be good. A little play, but that's good. I have some old uh, pallet wood. And I want to put up as a doorstop somewhere in here. That's about halfway. No, it's not. <laughs> okay, that's better. Now. Ugh. Oh. There again. Okay. Ah, uh, ish. Throw a couple of holes. Uh, and now, oh, oh, I think I'm getting too old for this. Now, this goes after. Okay. This is the chicken door. Yay! I have to put a latch on it. Or, um, good news. Yep. Well, I don't know. I haven't perfected it quite yet, but this is the beginning of it. And all I did was I put a spacer in here. Put that through, put it all through this bit of plywood. Put a spacer here so that it has something to rest on, as you can see. And the same thing, of course, over here. Ignore these bits, they were just for a test. Um, but that is the pop hole. I'm so excited. And with a little bit of struggle, the floor is in. Now, I put screws in at the corners, and one or two out at the corners, but I also did one at the doors so that if it warps, there won't be a problem. There's one over there, one there, and one over there, so that it won't warp. And I'll be doing the same thing over here, but I have to get the other side on. I think I need a break again. The floor about killed me. I had to put it over the top of an inn and it was terrible. And no, I'm not showing you. Um, <laughs> but, uh, so I have to do the side and then 
story. Oh, man. Okay, for those wondering about the sides, because, you know, one side of the chicken coop, the back of it is six feet tall, and the front is six and a half. Well, the sides have to be the angle. For those wondering about it, I'm going to show you how to do it. First, you measure the, the span across which is 74 and 3 quarters, in my case. Always check your own. And do that in several different places on plywood so that I can measure it across. I use a 2x4, it's absolutely straight, I, I, I was shocked and amazed that it was that straight. Mark, put it on your marks, wherever they might be, there you go. Okay, and then strike a line. I like that. Now. Remove this, and there's the nice, pretty line. These are going crazy around here. I'm sure you're going to be hearing them. Uh, then, set it to where... Right, okay. This side is 45 and a half. And this side, for me, is 39 and a half. Handy dandy, extremely long. Two by four. Tell you what I'm going to do. Because every time I do this, I move it, which is never fun. that end and then just like that you have a cockeyed line Woo! something like really cockeyed cottage here of course, you know what comes next. <laughs> Me with power saws. <laughs> <laughs> okay. board. Oh. Now this is the hard part. <laughs> Just imagine. All by myself I have to hold this. 
on now. These wouldn't open all the way, so I took a hasp, it had a, a bump here, I took a rasp to a hasp, and now it'll go all the way, not happily, but it will do it, so now I'm going to put them on the door, I have the hasp, basically I'm just going to set this thing up here and screw it in. for a door jam. But I got it fairly inexpensively yeah, like at um, the um, what is it called? The Restore. Habitat for Humanity Restore. Boy, I'm telling you, you can get some great deals there. I found all kinds of wonderful things. Now, Excuse me. And put this up here with this underneath. Like so. Okay, that's where I want it. <laughs> okay, fine. Well, you know that's going to mess up with me. So. is put it in and then take it out again so I know exactly where to put it Yes, I know. The 
Who's it going through? No problem. Not deck the doors anyway. Okay, so that's where it's going. Now I can put uh, I'd stop dropping everything. This through, this here, and put the screws back in. dog fight in the background and they've now made nice. Boy, don't you wish humans were that easy? Hopefully, it can't. No creature can get in. No creature can get out. I'm almost done. I'm so excited. Well, it's a mess. But it's mine. <laughs> it's as cockeyed as it can be. <laughs> but that's okay. Look at there. The latches are on. And there's so many screws in the thing. I don't think anything can get in. I need to work on the door, the pop door, but other than that, it's actually doing pretty darn well. So, I'm exhausted, and now I'm going to take a bit of a rest.